Hello everybody and welcome to Pokemon X Catch them all with me the Trunkleton. Today we are gonna do some catching Pokemon. So hang on, let me check my Pokemon. I'm gonna switch far I switch Farfetch out to the front. I put Caterpie on our team. Got rid of uh Fletchling for now. And we need to catch some Pokemon. Flabebe. So we need to catch this. Right, why is Farfetch'd out in front? Because he's the lowest level we have. Which might help in catching Pokemon. So let's do this. Hopefully we do some decent damage. Hopefully he doesn't die. So I put Gatsby in a team because we want him to evolve. Hopefully today or in the next few days. And the problem is if I'm going to be training up some Pokemon. Which I can't see happening right, right now. But... I'm going to have to switch the EXP shirt off, which is on right now, by the way. So that hit three times. What am I going to use? This Flabebe is quite strong. Hmm. Let's use Fury Cutter. Hopefully I don't kill it. Oh, it didn't do too much damage. I think we might be okay. Let's try. Ooh. Let's try catching this Pokeballs. How many do I have? I have one great ball, six Pokeballs. We're going to have to buy some. Should have bought some before we started the episode. I forgot about that. Let's hope we catch this Flabebe. Come on. So as we've seen that, we got a Flabebe. I think it was a yellow flower. We need to catch all the different variants. I'm going to do that off camera though. It's not something I'm going to do on camera. That would just be crazy. Catching one is enough. But... We have a few Pokemon to catch in this route. So the one thing I like about the skin is the roots for one are all different pretty much. They all have different Pokemon on. Let's just read this. It was the yellow flower. It draws out and controls the hidden power of flowers. The flower Flabebe holds is, is most likely part of its body. Uh, we won't give a nickname to it. So yeah, the other colours I will be catching. We will be evolving them all into the different colours. Just not right now. We need to go buy Pokeballs and we need to heal up Farfetch'd. This is craziness. I can't believe it took so much damage. The thing is our other Pokemon are just too high, I think. Too high a level. So let's heal them up first. To be taken on this route. So, oh, Farfetch'd just leveled up. He should be okay for now. But I don't think we have any other Pokemon around the level we need. That either too low... Oh, just not good enough. Too low or too high, basically. Let's buy. Let's buy. We can get great balls. Let's just buy. Let's buy ten pocky balls first. Get the free. The free. What's it called? The premier ball. Let's buy. Let's say five with these. Oh, we can't. We can buy four. Let's buy four. That'll do. We're okay on everything else. We already had one great ball, so we're okay. That was because of Bunnelby. Bunnelby is awesome. He finds so so many cool things on the road. And like I said, I'm walking because the position of my hands it's hard to control. Uh, it's hard to control the the roller skates. So what have we got here? A skitty. Awesome. Let's catch Skitty. So let's try. Both level 8. Let's try Fury Cutter first. The thing is with Fury Attack is it can do a lot of damage if it hits 5 times and we might kill the Pokemon. Oh, I hate it when this happens. Farfetch fell in love and will not attack again. Oh, he's immobilized by love. We're going to so fail. Let's keep going. Let's try again. Oh, he used it. Good job. Oh, look at that. We might be able to catch Skitty now. We'll use a great ball on Skitty. I think. Well, we'll try Pokeball first. Why not? Pokeball. Use. Come on. So this is two out of. Let me see. Let me check. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven Pokemon routes is going to be the hardest to find. We caught Skitty with a Pokeball. Awesome. And to be honest with you, I love the way the Pokeball looks. The Great Ball, I'm not a big fan of it. Looks Ultra Ball, it looks okay, but I still love the Pokeball. I don't know why. Caterpie grew to level 4. Awesome, this is why we're doing this. 
Let's read that Dex entry for Skitty. It can't stop itself from chasing moving things and it runs in a circle chasing its own tail. <laughs> Just like a normal cat. Nope. Okay. I have put the sound up a little bit on the game. We'll see how that goes on YouTube. Not too much. But hopefully. Let's explore this area because we've got things to find here. Let's just run through the grass. It doesn't matter if we run into a Pokemon, we're trying to catch some. So it's not a normal playthrough type. Okay, found a super potion. So hopefully next episode we get to go to Lumio City. Or hopefully this episode we might be able to make it there. Let's get all of these items. Trumpton found a great ball. Awesome, so we got an extra great ball. I think there's someone we can battle up here actually before we carry on. Well, maybe not this side. Oh, it's a maze. Um, how do I get out of here? Down and out. It's okay, let's see what. Hopefully it's something we can get. Oh, a ladybug. Awesome. Three new Pokemon. Three different fights. This is good. So let's... Fury Cutter. Nice. It's not, well, actually, it's not that nice. It didn't do much damage. We'll use, we will use Fury Attack this time, I think. At least we hit him. That's what I meant by nice. Oh, this could be good if we can get a few decent hits in. Two times. Okay, let's try that one more. Hopefully, we don't kill a lady, but let's get it down to at least yellow. One more, just for good luck. Stop now. Stop. No! No, why? Why far-fetched? Why? <sighs> far-fetched. Far-fetched. Why? You are the bane of my life. It took me forever to catch you. And now you just want to hurt the Pokemon I'm trying to catch. A crazy, crazy guy. So, there's a few things that's going to be troublesome, I think. With this is... Was it Sylveon? If we ever catch an Eevee. Oh, we can battle this dude. Let's switch Pokemon quickly. Let's stick out. Let's stick out Pikachu out front. Because I love, I love Pikachu. Let's stick Pikachu out front. Let's get Caterpie some levels by battling this dude. I warn you, youngster. My crawfish here has something sharp. Some sharp pincers. Okay, let's do this. Come on, Wheaton. Will Wheaton. Let's go. So, crawfish. It's just a water type, right? Or is it water and dark? Well, we only have Thunder Shock anyway, so let's try that. It's a decent. Oh, we got it in one. Awesome. Awesome awesomeness. Come on, Bunnelby grew to level 6. We might be able to use him in battle now. Caterpie grew to level 5. Awesome. So two more levels, Caterpie will evolve. Which is good news, good news, guys. We need them to evolve. Ah, how am I meant to get that now? I'm going to go a long way around. Urgh, craziness. Got an antidote. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. So we're going to go further ahead. I can't just stick around here looking for... <laughs> looking for Pokemon. Let's go a bit further ahead. Let's get... Let's battle this, these dudes. Just wait here for, for him to come around. That sounds crazy, but... It's going to be the best way to do it. Got him. Instead of trying to chase after him. Challenged by Roller Skater Roland. <laughs> My God. Some bad names. Oh, that's just pure luck that we have a Pikachu out front. I swear that I haven't got anything written down telling me what these people have in the inventory as their Pokemon. It's just I wanted to play with Pikachu. And it worked. Let's try and get Caterpie evolved. Grow our Pokedex a bit. Oh, nice. Farfetch wants to move learn Aerialist. Let's forget a move. Let's get rid of Sand Attack. This might come in handy, this Aerial Ace, and catching these new Pokemon. And Farfetch'd land Aerial Ace. Awesome! 
Caterpie grew to level 6, awesome as well. So we defeated that guy. One more. One more level for the Caterpie. It's good. So where's this girl? Where's the other roller skater? There she is. Yes. Let's beat her as well while I drink some coffee. <laughs> Mmm. A fledgling. So we should be okay as well here because we got Pikachu out front. Wow. Um, I wonder how Quick Attack would do against some of these other Pokemon. Not these ones, I mean uh, the ones we're going to be trying to catch. Because that could help. Bunnelby grew to level 7, so Bunnelby is definitely in contention. Bunnelby learned Quick Attack, which is awesome. Oh, Caterpie didn't level up. Damn you, Caterpie. Damn you. So let's see what's on the other side of this round thing. What is this round thing? I can't quite see. Oh, there we go. I don't know what Pokemon that is. Is it even a Pokemon? They're horses. It's something that has an umbrella. Anyway, it doesn't matter too much. We got some grass there. Is there anything in these bushes? Oh, honey. What does honey do? Sorry, it just looked too obvious. I, I keep saying this in my other games. It's just a bit obvious sometimes. We got more trainers. And we do have a Pokeball right here. Poison Barb. I think that's good for bug Pokemon, right? Or maybe not. Let's talk to this guy. I can tell by the look of the face, you just love Pokemon. I do. How did you know? Just by the look at my face. So, you have a kid with you? And you send out a Pichu. Pichu versus Pikachu. This is going to be cool. Not a big fan of Pichu, sorry. I don't think he looks good. I don't like his ears. They're too, way too big for him. It's all to make him look cute. And it, I don't know. Pikachu looks better in my opinion. We got it in one go. Awesome. Sorry, Pichu. The rest of your team gain experience point. The Caterpie. Uh, will I switch Pokemon? I will switch Pokemon because this is going to be bad. Let's send out. Let's send out Quilladin. Let's use him in battle. Let's see how good he is. Cool. He looks so cool. It looks like he could just roll up into a ball and just smash his way through everyone so let, let's you bite I don't think a grass move would really work or are they strong against electric Pokemon I know ground is well Pikachu flinched let's use Bang Whip he used a super potion you naughty boy he meant to let me win oh, I was quite strong anyway that Bang Whip Quilden's paradised. Oh no. Bigga bigga. I love the I love the noises that they gave for Pikachu. I think Bidoof is has it as well. He goes Bidoof. I right, grew to level 17. Awesome. The rest of our team gained experience. Caterpie's gonna evolve. Caterpie's gonna evolve. So happy now. This is the whole point to expand our Pokedex. Here we go. Come on, Caterpie. Do do. I love the music for the evolving and it hasn't changed in a while as well. It's awesome. My only problem is it just takes a bit long for them to evolve. I think I said that before. It's Metapod! 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 Yeah. So, we're going to look at his Pokedex entry because that's all part of this. You learn Harden, which is not a very good move in my opinion. So, let's look at this Pokédex entry for Metapod. I love this Pokédex, it's so nice. Central Kalos Dex, I guess. So where are you, Metapod? There it is. A hard steel shell protects its tender body. It's quite, it quietly endures hardship while waiting evolution. Awesome. Okay. Oh, we didn't look at Quilladin, did we? Let's look at Quilladin. Let's see what it says though. Oh, did I check it out? I'm not 100% sure, but let's do it anyway. 
Uh, where are you? There you are. It relies on its dirty shell to deflect predator attacks. It counterattacks with sharp quills. Awesome! I don't think we read that. But there we go. So, what next? Who next? We don't want to go up there because that's Tulumio City and we're not ready to go up there yet. Uh, who do I have out in front? Do I still have Pikachu? I think he has another crawfish here. Yeah. Let's send out Pikachu. Pika Pika. Partire Way is famous for these hedgerow gardens. If you can defeat me, I'll tell you what the official name is. Awesome. We might have to talk to him afterwards though. Grover. Gardener Grover. Yeah, he did have crawfish. That was lucky. Because it uses him to cut the, the hedges. So let's use Thunder Shot. Come on, that's just an easy battle. That was nice though. We like the easy battles sometimes. Pikachu grew to level 16. Awesome. The rest of your team gained experience punch. Farfetch grew to level 10. It should be a lot better now for catching these Pokemon. Bunnelby grew to level 8. I'm not trying to grow Bunnelby by the way. I'm just keeping them around so he collects items off the ground. Uh, as I promised, I'll tell you the official name. They're known as the Geometric Gardens. Okay, there we go. We found out the name. Ooh, got a netball. That would be great for bug Pokemon or water Pokemon. The netball and item. But I, I like the look of that ball as well, actually. It's a nice looking Pokeball. Uh, you can tell by now I'm a bit kind of biased towards certain Pokeballs. Dusk Ball is the best ball in the game, though. Unless you're in a long battle and obviously the time of ball is. Let's beat this guy. Behold these glorious moves I've that I've been honed and perfected in the garden. Oh, oh. <sighs> a bit tired today. Ooh, crazy. Come on, Fabian. Let me defeat your crawfish with my Pikachu. And then we're gonna catch some Pokemon. Uh it's fun to shot. We still got a few Pokemon to catch this episode. I want to try and catch them all. So that's the mission anyway. So I think there's only a few people we haven't beat on this route and we'll try and beat them towards the end of the episode. Lately I grew to level 18. Awesome. Metapod didn't grow, did he? I didn't see. I was looking at my timer. <laughs> Making sure we got time for everything. Let's just check quickly. Oh, Bonobi has something. Item, take a potion. Metapod is level 8, so yeah, he did grow a level. Awesome. You guys should have seen that on camera. I just didn't. <laughs> Let's get this item. Uh, Trunkleton found an Aoife. Awesome. Now let's go. Let's switch Pokemon. Should have done this already. Let's send out Farfetch level 10 now. Switch with Pikachu. And let's go look for a Pokemon. So I will be back once I have found a Pokemon first of all. What are you? Oh, Ladybug. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. This could be good. I switched to Bonobi because Farfetch kept killing Pokemon. Let's use Quick Attack. Ah, this is a nice low level Ladybug as well. I prefer them to be lower levels, guys. Just so you know, that's just the way I am. That's why I want to catch them in the earliest place possible as well instead of... Just randomly running into them over roots. Don't kill it. Oh, perfect. Perfect. I love you, Bonobi. You do a good job. Don't like Farfetch who keeps killing the Pokemon. I swear down. Oh, we got, I got another Pokeball. Let's put Ladyba in a Premier Ball. I think it'll look cool in a Premier Ball. His white feet kind of look like a Premier Ball. And then he's got the red wings. It's sort of kind of cool. Please go in. Don't get out. Don't get out. Don't waste my Premier Ball. Yeah, perfect. I love it. This is my favorite Pokeball after the Pokeball itself. Actually, to be honest with you. As to be, uh, I love the Premier Ball. It looks so nice. So here we go, Lady Bar. When the weather turns cold, lots of la Lady Bar gather from everywhere to cluster and keep each other warm. Oh, it's cute. It's cute, cute, kitty. Little kitty pie. Okay, so I'll be... Gonna find another Pokemon, I'll be back then. 
What do we have here? What do we have here? Combi! Let's go. Let's catch this combi. This should be okay. Hopefully Bono B doesn't destroy it. Uh, let's do a quick attack. I think Ralts is going to be the biggest one to find. It's going to be the hardest one to find for sure. And I think after this it's just Badu. Ralts and Badu to find after, after combi. So, we're going to use a Pokeball now. I wish there was a yellow colour Pokeball. I don't know. I reckon Pokemon should be in certain colour balls. <laughs> it's just the way it is with me. That's the way I prefer it. Let's go. Pokeball. Capture this combi. It's low enough level. He should be okay to capture like this. Come on. Come on. No. Are you kidding me? All right, just because I don't want to waste any more Pokeballs, we'll use a Great Ball on it. We should capture it. We got a few great balls. That's what they're here for. Just to make sure. Because I don't want to kill it. I, I, I have to catch it. Now, Ralts is going to be a bigger problem. Hopefully, we can find Ralts soon. But we're going to do some more. We are going to do some more fighting right now. It's yeah, just to mix it up a bit. But it'll be good to level 9. Awesome. Just 15 gain experience points. Combi data with added to Pokedex. Let's see what it says. Let's see what it says. The trio is gathered together from birth. It consistently gathers honey from wildflowers to please Vespiquin. No, I don't want to give an name to Combi. Combi, I do like the look of Combi. I think it's a cool looking Pokemon. My opinion. So... Let me switch up my team. Let's stick out. Let's stick out Litleo. Let's switch with Bono B. We're just going to do a little bit of training. We're going to beat the trainers. I think we've got two left to beat this little girl here. And one other person. Hey, listen. I'm going to win this battle. No, you're not. I am. I'm going to win. The Trunkleton. Mia. Okay, Mia. You got a Padu? I want a Padu. Okay, Litleo should be good here. We haven't used him this episode, that's why I wanted to put him out. Plus, he's full health. <laughs> so, let's fight. Let's use Ember. This is a good move. Against Padu. See, he killed it in one. See, perfect move. I think we've only got one more battle to do. I don't know how many Pokemon this little girl has. That was it. So, yeah, one more battle. Just to split the episode up a bit instead of just catching, we'll clear the route out. It's how it's going to be in some other episodes as well. So he's got this little boy to do. Oh no, we got her. Let's do her first. I love my Pokemon. I love my Pokemon. Okay, okay. <sighs> Challenged by Pokefan Ag Agnes. Send out Burmy. Oh, I think I have to find a Burmy as well. Or do I have a Burmy? I think we have one, don't we? Maybe I'm just losing my mind. Let's fight Ember. I think we have a Burmy. Kill it. Good job. I know I have one on Y. Did we catch one on this game? Was it in another route? I'm sure it's on another route. I'm sure we got Burmy already. No, I'll not switch Pokemon. Send out your Burmy. Come on. Oh, it's in its other form. I've got to figure out how to get them in these forms. I can't remember how. I think you... you you do something in other areas. You just battle them in other areas. Or something. Or is it if you catch it in a certain area? I have no idea. I can't remember. Oh, it's going to switch to the last, last Burmy farm. I do like this about some of these Pokemon. that have different farms depending on areas and stuff. It just gives... I don't know. It just makes me want to catch more Pokemon. This is the thing, my favourite part about the game. Is getting all the Pokemon. The battling. I do enjoy battling. But... I'll probably end up loving it more once I really start competitive battling, actually. It's just going to be a problem for me because I might get addicted to it. But I do want to try IV and EV training. IV breeding first and then EV training the IV Pokemon. I think that's just going to be a nice challenge. Something I'm going to have to do with a lot off camera, but still. Might do some of it on camera. i got to figure that out. And it's Magic Carp. Do I have a move that is not fire? 
that is the question. It's level 9. All it should know is splash. I have tackle. Okay, let's choose tackle. And we killed it in one for tackle. Awesome. Magikarp fainted. I don't think he has a Gyarados. Not yet, anyway. Okay, we defeated him. And... I might have to turn the EXP share off, depending on... Uh, depend I'm going to... Let's see, Pokemon. Yeah, we're gonna have to turn the EXP share off because Metapod is level nine, and we don't want to. I don't want to be fighting another Pokemon that. Let's use item. Let's take the item from Bonobi first. Take Hyper Potion. Are you kidding? A Hyper Potion. So I'm gonna go to Pokemon Center, heal up, and I'll be back in a bit. But do finally. Oh, craziness. Bunnelby went up a level, a level because a combi wouldn't let me escape battle. So I had to defeat it. But let's hopefully we catch this Badoo. Let's do one more of those quick attacks and hopefully we do. Uh, don't kill it. That's what we want. We don't want to kill it. I'm gonna use. I'm gonna use a great ball. I don't want this thing. It's took, taking me a while to catch it or even see one, so I don't want it to waste my Pokeballs. So we just use a great ball. Hopefully, you get it. And then we're gonna go for routes. Routes is last. Routes is gonna be a pain to find. I think even on my Y version, running around forever, I only found one and I never caught it. Or maybe I did. I can't remember. But either way. Who we got Bidu? That's what matters. Let's look for routes and I'll be back. One, well, no, I'll read this first. <laughs> when it feels the sun, warm, the sun's warm touch, it opens its bud to release pollen. It lives alongside clear pools. Okay, awesome. It's a cute little Pokemon. No, I'll not give you a nickname. I will be back once I've found a route, guys. Okay, finally found a route. Finally, oh, I do not want to kill this thing. I wish I had a quick ball right now. I could just throw at it. Let's just use one quick attack. And we're going to throw great balls at it until we catch it. Unless I have a weaker Pokemon I could toss out and just hope for the best. I do not want to lose this Pokemon. I want to just catch it. Please let me catch it. It took me so long. And it's a female so we can breed it, which is good. Please catch it. I'm begging you, game. I'm begging you. Please. Please. Oh. That is such a relief, guys. You do not know how long it has taken me to find this thing. I hope the sound is not messed up because I cannot do this again. Oh. My heart is pounding, guys. It took me so long. If it's horns... Capture the warm feeling of people or Pokemon, its body warms up slightly. Awesome, nice little thing. He's part fairy. I do not want to give him into routes. So what we're going to do now is finish the route. Let's go talk to these guys. Hello there. Have you heard of a Pokemon called Flabebe? Yes, I have one. Oh, I see. It's registered in your Pokedex. That's what I would expect for one of the professor's hand-picked Pokemon trainers. Flabebe is now... Flabebe is. Now brace yourself, a furry-type Pokemon. Furry-type is a new... But turn the entire matchup stood on its head. What? And we've been battling furry-type Pokemon against other type of Pokemon at Professor Sink Sycamore's request. My name is Sina. It's a beautiful name for a beautiful lady, if you say so. I am Dexio. Two years ago, Professor Sycamore entrusted me with a Pokédex. You could call me a Pokémon Voyage Veteran. If you'd like, I'd show you the way to the lab. So come along now. Yes. Okay, let's go. Sorry. Okay, let's get this show on the road. Ugh. Sorry, Ralts has sent me weird. So let's just do this part, and then after that I'm going to catch all the flip, baby. So let's keep going. Let's get into this next city. So how are you and your Bunnelby getting along? The more you walk around your Pokemon, the stronger your friendship become. 
will become. Here, take this TM for return. This is a move that gets more powerful when your friendship with a Pokemon using it is strong. So we use return. Awesome. Right, through this gate and you'll be in Lumios City. Go on ahead. Let's just go. Let's see what's going on in Lumios. Be a nice ending to our to our episode, I think. Lumios City. It's the Eiffel Tower in the background. I don't know what it's called here. Let's just do this bit of story. I'll go ahead and wait for you in front of the lab for you. Follow her that way to the lab. Well guys, I want to thank you for watching. There's the Pokemon Lab right there. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please leave a like. If you want to watch some more, subscribe. Next episode, we'll be doing some special things. So please subscribe if you want to watch that. And I'll see you next time. Thank you. Bye-bye.